Hello and welcome, Paul here. And I've made a pretty interesting discovery, which I will show you now. This is over at the quarry. And I just want to point out, I've actually finished the uh, beams that hold up the uh, rail cart track once it's done. It's not done yet, but you know, it's getting there. But all the beams are done, it took a while, and uh, I think it looks pretty good, so just get up here. One thing I will need to do, like I've said many times already, is make a surrounding for this. I may attempt it later, I don't know yet. It just needs doing, I know that. Uh, somehow this cow got up here, I don't know how. Hello cow, I'll leave him up here. I wouldn't want to be down there either, with the likes of Mr. Creeper there. Okay. Must be the uh, hangout spot for squids. So as you can see, all the beams are done, and if the beam goes into water, it is sitting on top of cobblestone. I think that looks pretty nice. But yeah, it definitely uh, bulks it up a bit. It took a lot of wood, but it's done. So all I need to do now is get the bloody track finished, and we shall head over here. See, it still continues here. Perhaps I should have done that like at every point, put a uh, cobblestone, but I don't know. I think it's fine without. But what do you think? Let me know. So, the quarry. Now, I came here, started digging, figured I'll dig down a bit and try and find me some gold, because I'm going to need it. And as I was going down, I could hear, you know, like uh, moaning and groaning and spiders and you know, all sorts of nasty creatures down here, and, uh, what do you know? It dug down a little bit, and then, pow! There was a huge drop into... here. Let me see if I can show you. A huge drop down into this massive... Now, I don't want to say it's a canyon. I don't think it's a canyon. It, that was my first, uh theory on this, thinking it was, you know, like a big canyon down here, but it isn't. At least I don't think it is. It looks more like uh, just a giant room. <laughs> so, that's actually pretty cool. What's going on with his head there? I'm not sure. But, so I started digging down, trying to get to the bottom of this. And, uh, well, yeah, that's why I'm here. Here now, now, I've just realised I've balked something up. This episode, I wanted to try and get down there and get it lit up. So, you know, I could get in there and start mining properly, but there's a lot of mobs down there. Um, I mean, I can take my chances going down. I, don't, I, have, I reckon I can, you know, I'll do a lot of damage, kill most of them. The only ones which are going to cause me problem is the skeletons, because, you know, they can hit me at range. Creepers, spiders, zombies, I don't think... I think I can handle them, basically, is what I'm saying. But when you start throwing skeletons in, into the mix at range, who are just, you know, they're sending arrows hurling my way, you know, it's not good. Uh, it's also dark down there, I can't see anything, and I don't think I'm going to have time to defend myself. Ooh, here's, an, here's a proper canyon. Sweet. What sucks is though, why, why, why can't it be uncovered? Maybe I'll, maybe I'll do that. Maybe that could be a project to uncover the uh, canyon here. So, what I need, what I wanted to do because it's dark is find that lava pit that was around here. Get a bucket tip it down there, hopefully it will kill some of the mobs, but it should also light up the place. Now I'm going to go in there and uh, take names and kick ass, so that's the plan anyway. So I have my bucket, in fact let me just do a little bit of moving around here. 
I'll put my iron pick up for the moment. I'm going to want torches close. <laughs> I want my water bucket close in case I catch them on fire. I'm going to put some dirt there just in case I have to build an emergency barricade. You never know. I picked up some wheat to turn into bread, but of course I never got around to doing that. I'd have probably been quicker going into my base, going down to the uh, mine and just getting lava from there. But I'm doing this the hard way, so... Well, that looks weird. Anyway. I do think I prefer the... Doku Craft lava. But this is still pretty nice. Yeah, these two are definitely my favourite packs. Uh, Doku Craft to John Smith. You know, I like them both. I've started to... Uh, move towards uh, John Smith texture pack a bit more. I really like the grass and dirt. It looks very nice indeed. I think both of them do things very well. There was a time when I was using Doku Craft. You know, I looked at John Smith texture pack and stuck my nose up at it. I was like, meh, meh. It's a bit too dark, he would use this meh, you know. But so now I'm loving it, so it's weird. So, okay, the sun, of course the sun's going to be setting before I even get back. Oh well, at least I've got a, a pretty safe route to go back and forth now, so it's not really a problem. How do I get down from here? Oh, like that, okay. So, I, I need to at least make a way to get down into that uh, little room. Now, I think I know which direction I should go in that little uh, pathway I was mining, so if I finish that up, it should take me down there. I'm hoping the lava is going to light up the room enough to stop things uh, spawning and maybe even kill them. So... Again, I've got my water ready in case I... Uh, Tip lava on my foot. Okay. Be bloody careful. Look at all the iron. Uh, I mean, this is lighting it up pretty nicely, but... <laughs> In fact, wow, yeah, they did a fantastic job. But I'm hearing all the mobs over this side now, so I think they've just shifted so they can get to me. Oh my god. I'm hearing something on the other side of this wall. That's what it sounds like, anyway. It just sounds like the zombies. I'm not hearing any any other kind of uh, movements. There was a spider down here, but I don't see it now. I must be getting close. Is he above me? Oh, crikey, I'm right. Hello? Well, that's one way in. I really do not like that though. I have no... I can't see anything. At least nothing can get in this way. I might get shot at, but... See in there. Not much to look at though. I'll be careful because it's going to be night time here soon and my way out is going to be blocked, although I could just spend the night down here. 
It's not going to make much difference. I don't think anything's going to come from the surface. Although, they did upgrade the mob AI, didn't they? Can't say I've noticed it much, but... That's the last thing I want is a zombie navigating its way all down here. So this looks like a completely separate... I see, so it's just going further down. Okay. Okay, just because I'm paranoid as hell, let's stick that there. Oh. Snap. So, quickly update, yeah, I hear zombies down there, I hear skeletons, but I'd like to get round and have a better look. So, whoa, oh my god, <laughs> I thought lava was just about to burst in then. Oh man. Here we go, this gives me a better view of the area. Perhaps it doesn't. It's all dark. Hmm. Hmm. Which way should I... First of all, let me just block this up because I do not want to get jumped. This is it, because if zombies are smarter, let me just make a quick safe room here. Just need to... Uh... There we go. Whoa. Whoa, it seems like they're all coming out at once. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> okay, that was poorly designed, I admit. Okay. It's gone. <laughs> Gotta be careful now. Oh my god, I see him. He's just round this corner. <laughs> oh, crikey. Okay, well, let's see if I can get down this way. Gotta be a way down here. Oh my god. That's it, burn. Come on, burn already. There we go, one down. Many to go, I imagine. Okay, let's clear this. We're gonna go in. <laughs> Let me just have a quick look this way again. It's so dark. All right, nothing else for it. I'm just gonna go in there and just spam torches. So let's give this a go, shall we? Worst comes to worst, I come back here and block this area up. Oh, I don't want to do this. Ah. Oh, actually, I think uh, it's pretty clear. <laughs> well, what is this place? There was a lot more here when I first discovered it, so I'm thinking the lava helped with uh, stopping them spawn. Well, what is that? Oh, it's a skeleton, isn't it? Yep. <laughs> I thought it might have been like a, 
you know, a little bit of daylight, but I'm trying to save arrows, but I want to try and damage them a little bit of ranged. There we go. God, look at this place. I can't even see the roof. Oh. <laughs> now it's getting interesting. I don't want to use all my arrows down here, though. Creeper, I should be able to hit once now. Oh, oh snap! You see that? A record? You must have got hit by the... Sweet! Music disc. That's my first music disc I've ever gotten. That's awesome. Okay, sweet. Now I just need to make a musical player, don't I? I think I do. Oh, this is uh, pretty nice, this area. Uh oh. Okay, stay alert. Mr. Creeper down there. This place is absolutely huge. I'm not quite sure what to make of it. <laughs> okay. Lots of resources down here. This is going to be a shame to turn this into a quarry, it's just a nice big natural cavern, but at the same time, this is what it's going to look like anyway once I'm done, so. <laughs> hmm. Okay, let's, uh... Go ahead and make a few more torches. I feel like I'm going through them too quick. More lava, a couple of creepers. Lava fall, even. Hey, buddy. What you doing? I feel bad, but he's looking at me. Why? Well, he's only going to blow up if I get near him. There we go. Nothing like punching a creeper to death. Problem with this texture pack is the creepers look kind of cute with their faces, so makes you feel bad. Well, hey. Spider, but I see there must be a uh, way to tick. Is this that uh, canyon? That canyon, I uh... <laughs> oh god, I don't want to fall down there. Okay, let's get away from here. I think that's that canyon, so the the two places kind of meet up. Well, that's cool. Whoa, that's not cool. I want to fall to my death. Oh god. That's not good, it means it's too dark in here still. But where? <laughs> I see, I do see some pretty dark spots, but... Okay. There's something up there. I just heard a spider. Okay, I've put a few more torches down. I'm trying to get down here now. Mr. Zombie there. Pretending he, I, he's ignoring me until I get close, he's going to turn and pounce. Oh, 
here. I feel like something's behind me. Oh my god, it still carries on going. <laughs> well, what do you know? Holy crap! Oh man! Oh man! <laughs> oh, okay, um, pay attention, Paul. Sorry, folks, let me just light this up. No, no. <gasps> A slime! Oh my god! Hey, buddy! This is like the best place ever. I thought I was a creeper then, like a little creeper. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just trying to light this up a bit. I want to go back and look at that fantastic cavern, but I've got to secure myself first. Okay, well, I'm going to have to take out this slime, although I don't want to, but I am short for slime balls, so there's no guarantee he's going to come back. Oh, I didn't get one. Oh, I'm sorry, little man. Little fella. Okay. So. This is going to keep going the cavern, which is good, but I'm not going to have time to explore it all in this episode. However, it's good to know it does go a fair ways down, so I can, you know, come down and get all the gold I need. And also, I mean, look at this. That looks fantastic. Not quite sure what to make of that, but it looks insanely cool. I mean, we got lava falls, waterfalls, and the water's turned the uh, lava into obsidian, of course, and... I just like the way it's dotted around. It looks wild. So... Now, here's the other thing. I think this is a separate canyon to uh, the one that we'd just looked at, you know, that's uh, back up here and uh, you can get to from the surface. So that's kind of interesting to know. We've got a few different things down here. I'm um, looking around now. Uh, I think I'm pretty well set. I've got a big, big mining operation then to uh, get sorted out. There's another slime down here. Oh my god. He scared me. <laughs> it looks like he's stuck. <laughs> the only place he could stand up under here. That's kind of funny. I'd try and kill him, but he'd just teleport away. and I don't want to be stalked in caves by a... Alright, can he get to me without getting burns? God, die! So he hurt me pretty bad. So yeah, this is a ginormous uh, cavern. <laughs> or just cave network. Keeps going. So we found slimes down here. I've got a record. We've just seen some cool canyons. And it looks like it will go all the way to uh, bedrock, I reckon. I mean, hell, this path looks like it might. I'm not going to look at the moment, though. I think uh, mining in here will be saved for another time. I just need to make sure I've got all this secured. I'm pretty sure I've got enough. In fact, I need to make an easier way to get up. Easier way to get up. Oh, I 
I see. I wish you could like throw torches and the light carries with them. Although it wouldn't work if I set it in a stream of water, I guess. Okay, so we're back up top now. I think that's it for this episode. It's been mostly exploring, so I apologize if that's boring for any of you, but uh, I think we've seen some pretty awesome stuff. And it's great to know that this quarry is in a prime location. So, I mean, look at all this iron. There's iron everywhere down here, so that must mean there's going to be gold as well. That's what we're here for. We want gold for this track. So, once we have those sorted, you know, we're we'll ready. I'll begin all proper mining preparations. I'm going to develop this area a little bit, uh, perhaps get some scaffolding so we can get down easier, you know, make it look the ticket. And uh, yeah, well, then we'll be able to move on to other projects. I know I still want to do that jungle temple, but it looks like I might be able to do something pretty cool down here too. Hell, you never know, we might see a return of uh, Miner's Haven. After looking at all these uh, cool looking canyons and such. So anyway, that's it for this episode. Uh, stay tuned next time. Some cool stuff. Thank you for watching.